Some of the highest tech at this year's Consumer Electronics Show is all about keeping you safe in your car. The Iris system, for instance, monitors everyone in your car. It can alert drivers if they seem drowsy or can keep track of babies in the back seat and warn drivers when things look dicey. Cameras are everywhere today and their number increases um, regularly every single day. It is literally a, uh, a public space. If Think about it, if you're sharing a vehicle, it is more of a public space, similar to when you walk into a bank or a movie theater or even this space in here. Other devices monitor drivers' behavior behind the wheel. The Affectiva car camera algorithms work in a way that's similar to online services like Amazon, which recommend products based on browsing habits. Its cameras track drivers and passengers' activity, recording things that catch their eye in places they stop. The system could offer coupons or discounts at restaurants and other businesses along the way. Right, we're a captive audience now in what is potentially an entertainment hub. Not always do we want to be entertained necessarily, right? So it's really important to understand what the needs are of the people of the vehicle and how they're reacting to the environment so you can then adapt the experience to those needs. It's all part of a shift to customize the driving experience, looking to a future where the driver's top priority isn't driving. But in a world where cars are truly self-driving, there is no steering wheel anymore, there is no human driver anymore. In that fully autonomous uh, future, um, there is no, no back seat as such anymore, right? It's, it's basically passengers in a vehicle that sometimes even by industry refer to as an entertainment hub. Some other tech is going in the opposite direction, trying to protect a driver's anonymity while helping to keep them safe. If you compare it to cameras, um, it has lower resolution, but it's uh, enough resolution to understand what's going on in the car while keeping your privacy. And that's a very good balance which we believe in. But whether it's onboard cameras or onboard radar, big changes are coming for cars as trips inevitably become less about driving and more about getting from place to place safely and comfortably. Kevin Enix, VOA News.